Hello everybody and welcome back. Um, so I'm going to be doing something just a little bit different here. Uh, I have for such a long time, uh, you know, now been playing all these multiplayer games. And um, one thing that I used to love about old fashioned gaming whenever I was able to actually get around to it back in the day was uh, single player playthrough games. Uh, you know, you just get sort of this experience that you can't quite seem to find anywhere else a lot of the times and this is something that I have been looking at and it had uh, quite a positive review actually and um, it's even free so you know what if you uh, want to check it out uh, feel free to go to the Steam store and look that one up uh, this is Cloud Climber now I don't know anything about the game and I only watched about a minute or two of the trailer for it but uh, I must say it does look uh, it does look rather amazing. So let me get my drink in here. I'm so thirsty. Mm. Excuse me. All right, here we go. So this is uh, Cloud Climber. Let's just hop right on into this here. I really hope they'll let me use a controller because I am not very good at using a keyboard and mouse, but I guess we'll figure it out as we go here. Another day has arrived. I had best get my water before going to work. Okay. So it looks like it looks like the controller does work. And I have to say I do um I actually really like the art. It looks kind of like the sort of thing you'd see as like a concept art for bigger type games. Um but I, I actually like the style of it, this sort of uh uh, comic like thing they have going on it's it's different it's, it's a little fast on the movement there but it's all right what do I chess key okay here we go, here we go. what's going on here uh, stand diary page uh, 1489 uh, I may need to get to the neighboring tower in the future but I know the other builders keep the entrance to the bridge locked I saw a key on the table at the top of the on the top of our tower a few weeks ago before I went to get more building supplies I haven't been up there so yeah man, I am so sorry I can't see that I haven't been up there in a few days, so I'll need to check if it unlocks the bridge door. If the towers ever become vacant, I might need to get across, so I'll have to keep this in mind. So, it's a, I didn't think there would be, maybe, maybe there's like NPCs or something, because uh, it did say that this was supposed to be sort of like an end of the world type thing, and I, you were the last uh, one and whatnot, so I did to... to how do I view inventory? What did it say? Inventory. Okay, alright. All right. Construction on the last tower stopped weeks ago. I can only assume that, that the builders is... have met their fate by now. Met their fate? I but believe it's the... safe enough for me to go and continue building higher yet from where they left off. Oh, yeah, because I'll you know... i to travel across the other two towers to get there, but... I'm sure I can find a way. Yeah, that can't possibly go wrong. End of humanity and the last of the builders on whatever and whatever you're building that tower all the way up here cannot see anything down below. But, uh, hey, you know what? I guess uh, you just, you know, you got that confidence, so we'll see where it goes. What's going on in here? Let's open another letter. There we go. Ah, uh, Bernie the Great and Terrible Diary, page 69. Lol. Anyways, uh, for months we've been building faster than ever, yet it seems as if every time we complete a new level, the clouds raise higher and higher. I could have sworn we were close to them decades ago. Uh, but we're still not done yet. I can only hope that we're getting close. Signed, Bernie the Great and Terrible. I apologize, my reading skills is not the best in the world. Why can I not? I can't. I can't get out. There we go. I don't know. We'll let me get out of the note. God, I really do love the art though. It, it's quite nice. I must 
must say. Very, uh, very beautiful. Okay, I was wondering if I could fall off. I guess uh, there's just some sort of higher power that doesn't want me to die here today. Okay, shack full of stuff. For some reason I can't open that door, even though I'm pretty sure it just leads to the other side. There's no sprint function, so... Uh, what? Uh, oh, so I, I guess I can only open it from the outside. That's interesting. Joey Diary, page 420. I've been building all day long and Bernie the Great and Terrible has been sitting on his butt, acting as foreman, aka he doesn't do any work, and drinks all our water. I've started locking my water chest, uh, just in case he really does think he's above us all. What is the... How do I, I... What is going on with this? Where can I know... Okay, there we go. I don't know what's going on with the notes. Locking me in all of a sudden. The first one didn't do that. It's weird. Wow. Look at that. Oh, okay. And there's like other towers off in the distance. That one looks like it's on fire over there. Tons of fun. to know though if they haven't been down on the ground in decades where they're growing all these friggin trees here to keep this stuff going but uh, I guess we'll just have to be imaginative on that one that looks like a comfortable bed oh that's see that's adorable look at that right there that's so cute little smiley face Alright, uh, Edna Diary, page 36. I can't believe today is the 100th anniversary of our tower. I know others have been building much longer, and now I wish our grandparents had taken this whole thing more seriously. A uh, hundred years ago, they decided things were getting dangerous, but they didn't see the problem 200 years ago. Question mark? It's like, God, we've been living in these towers for hundreds of years now. Um... Alright then, uh, or even longer, uh, I'm glad they started building, but I just wish we had seen this coming. I mean, I don't know, you, you've been up here for hundreds of years, somehow, I, I mean... It's been quite some time since I was on the second tower. I haven't crossed this bridge since the builders became greedy and took the supplies that were meant to come to our tower. Just like all the other towers, its inhabitants quickly grew desperate and aggressive. Now it stands empty. Kyle Diary, page 45. Uh, I guess I knew this day would come, but I didn't expect it to come this soon. Yesterday we, st yesterday we started extreme rationing of our water. Uh, a few days back, we stopped getting supplies from the ground crew on a lift. We can only assume that they stolen the supplies for themselves, ran out of water and food resources, or simply died. If we don't get into the clouds soon, we might need to see if we can get some from one of the other neighboring towers. So, is this like, um, I'm very curious to know a little more of the lore behind this, you know, what exactly happened here. And on that note, I'm very, I would like to know, I mean, I guess they're getting the water and the food down from below. I imagine whatever this cloud is, isn't going to let you grow very much. So, I don't know. We'll see. Ah. Uh... Sounds. What's going on here? Just random door. Okay, sure, why not? Oh, here we go. Bertha Diary, page 9825. Dear Diary, 
Wouldn't it be ironic if it rained now? After decades of building, now would just be the perfect time since we've just started rationing our supplies more. Uh, but I have a good feeling about things. I know I've never seen rain myself, but grandmother always told me how wonderful it felt. It would be so surreal to be on the ground and see water for miles instead of desert and wasteland. I'm sure it will rain someday, we just need to survive until then. I've never seen rain before. Yeah, and see, that's another thing too. I mean, like, where are you getting there? If there hasn't been any rain, I don't know. How, like, how are you eating if there's been no rain and there's been, you know, where are you growing the food? I don't know. On this I level just... to get to the third tower. I should be able to use it to get across. Kyle Diary, page 46. I tried to be reasonable. I tried to talk with them, but those greedy little scumbags on Tower 1 didn't want to share their supplies with us. I'm not going to die miles above the ground, drying up like a raisin while other people watch. I'm going to go over there tonight and take everything I need so I can last long enough to watch everyone else die. Well, Kyle, aren't you kind of a dick? It's not even like a, oh, well, I'm going to go get supplies so everyone that I'm with here can survive. No, I'm going to go get supplies so I can outlive all of you and watch you die. You know, because I'm offended that you want to watch me shrivel up like a raisin, but by all means, man, I'm perfectly okay with just watching you keel over slowly and painfully. Kind of sounds kind of like a dick to me. Do I need to go up? Or will, yeah, I probably have to go up to get a key or something. Yeah, maybe. No, just cute little swirly there. All right. Right, don't I go? That looks safe. Yeah. Totally not gonna plummet to my unforeseen doom here. I love how the rope is like a bungee cord. <laughs> okay, how do I work? Okay, there we go. We're moving. I could almost call this place beautiful if these dust storms weren't so suffocating. It's gorgeous, actually. It uh, looks very nice. Yeah. I, hope I find what I'm looking for at the fourth tower. Giant gaps in the wood here. That's totally safe, up to standard. Had dang? Diary? Had dang? Hi. Sure. Uh, I couldn't be more frustrated right now. We're running out of water, running out of building supplies, and Carl just won't get along with me. At least five times a day, he pretends he's going to push me off the tower. I swear, if I do fall someday, it'll be his fault. Well, I don't think that uh, he'll be held up in court about it. It doesn't look like that's quite top priority, and if he's anything like Kyle, he will throw you off just for some water, so you know. Jerry Diary, page 556. Yesterday, had they fell off the tower. <laughs> of course, he fell off the tower. Uh, I don't know how it happened, but it's a shame, especially since he had the key to most of the water. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Need to break the locked ones open soon since we've almost emptied out the other chest. Yeah, he fell off. I'm sure he did. That's funny. If you look literally four feet, maybe, from the note that you just wrote in the diary that you, for some reason, tore a page out of and set it on the table, uh, I think you've got your first suspect right there. Okay, I'm not going that way. I guess uh, I just can't get over it. Hadane gives the absolute best reactions when I mess with him. For the past week, I've been pretending to get mad and shove my arms at him as if to push him off the tower. I don't think this will ever get old, and I can tell that Hadane loves it. You <laughs> Everyone just seems kind of like they're a bunch of asses, honestly. They don't, um... I don't know, man. It doesn't seem like anyone up here is really getting along, but hey, I'm glad people can keep a personality when they're living on crickety wooden towers way above the ground because the world's ended.
Looks like I'll need to fix this bridge. Uh, oh. Play stack of planks. Okay. Um. Where do I get that? Can I? Do I saw? Do I? What do I? Ah! Am I gonna have to go back and forth here? Am I gonna have to do? Okay. I've done it. I am the master architect. It's hard to believe that I'm the last one here. I never thought it would end like this. Makes you wonder what the whole point was in the first place. I must say you have a very cheery attitude for someone who seems to be the last person alive, but I guess that's just the insanity slowly creeping up. Oh my, that is... Them are some words. Okay, so y'all are free to pause and read all that if you want. Hey, here we go. I'll read the diaries. Um, Dewey. Hey, Dewey. <laughs> Okay, uh, Dewey Diary, page 490. This evening, Kevin made a really cheesy speech about how we alone prevail and we're the only descendants of the great ones who deserve life. Not, uh, not a little conceited there, but okay. Uh, it was honestly the cringiest speech I've ever heard, and that's really saying a lot considering all the other stuff he's been saying lately. He also keeps referring to himself in third person and only responds to us if we call him son of... Zilchar? Um... Yeah... So if that's your leader, I'd recommend putting up voting for a new one because he seems like he might just be going uh, a tad bit crazy. You know, a little too much dust cloud in the lungs or something. I don't know. But um, I would recommend new leadership. What the? What? I, I can't. Help. Okay. Would you stop? Go around. Thank you. All right. That. Okay. Looked like I was going to hit my head there. Oh, I saw. Oh, and okay. Guess I'll just grab everything. I'm putting all this in my uh, extremely large pocketed pants. I guess. Am I going to have to break in somewhere? I can't think of why else I would need a hammer and a soul. Ah. Bing, bing, bing. Oh, come on. That looks stable. Yeah. Alright, what's going on here? This place really is beautiful, even with the dust storms. It's yeah. peaceful in a way. I've been working on that tower my whole life and never once stopped to appreciate what we spent our lives building. We only looked up to the clouds hoping we'd someday reach them so we could prolong our lives. Now that everyone's gone, I know any attempt I might make at accomplishing that would be futile. Rather than spending the rest of my life building a tower, maybe it's time I took a break. It's been a long time, but I think I'm finally done. Oh, I thought he was about to jump. I straight up thought that man was about to leap off of this thing. Oh, it's raining. Oh, it's over. Oh my gosh. That was so quick, but also so good. Wow. Uh, you know, it, it's it's a little sad if you think about it, though, because it's like, 
you know, he finally just accepted the fact that I'm the last person and nothing else is going to help that. And, the, you know, I know that there's no chance at this point. So I'm just going to sit down. I'm going to relax and slowly go insane by enjoying the rest of my life alone. And then it rains. Like, how much of a kick in the nuts does it have to be to be like, well, if you had done this maybe, you know, a year ago, then I, I don't know. I just... <laughs> wow. Um, I had fun with that. It was simple. It was enjoyable. The art looks gorgeous I, I absolutely love the art style going on there and um yeah yeah i would recommend giving it a little play through yourself i know you just watched me do it but you know it's uh definitely has a bit of a um i don't know just it just has a bit of a touch to it that i really think uh you could enjoy more on a personal level if you were to walk through it yourself but um that is it for this one. Uh, I thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to be doing more of these playthroughs. I really am enjoying this. I am. Uh, I like this single player experience that I can walk through and have you guys experience it with me. You know what I mean? It's quite nice. But, uh... Alright, that is it for now. Uh, thank you all for watching so much. Make sure, you know, I gotta say it, generic YouTube thing here. Smash the like, get the subscribe, and ring the bell for more. Um, and I will say, I've gotten a lot of views. I do want to say thank you, honestly. I'm at 100 views, and I'm at 20 subscribers. And I got no one to thank but you guys for that. My videos are popping up in more places, and I am so excited to have more and more of you guys coming in and enjoying this content. Um, everybody have a lovely day. And I hope to see you in the next video. Cheers.